What's up, everybody? Welcome to the show. Today we're watching The View, everybody's favorite show. I know if you watch this channel, you love The View. <laughs> Just kidding. Let's get into it. Yesterday, the National Association of Black Journalists Convention invited you-know-who for an appearance. She's talking about Lord Voldemort. That really went off the rails from the very first question and Vice President Harris has already responded to these attacks he made on her yesterday. Mm -hmm. Take a look. But she was Indian all the way, and then all of a sudden she made a turn, and she went, she became a black person. Just to be clear. And it was the same old show. The American people deserve better. <laughs> NPCs clap now. So uh, what did he say wrong? What did he say wrong? I mean, he pointed out that they're making a different race than what she is to get more votes, which is seems to be what they're doing. So I do not know what he has said wrong here. Let's continue. <laughs> that whole table reeked of divorce. <laughs> you know what? I, I, I refuse. <laughs> I refuse because this is nothing new. This is yeah. not new. We knew this was who he was. This is yeah. who he's always been. So I'm not paying him any money except when I'm here. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Trump lives rent free in Whoopi Goldberg's head. This entire show revolves around paying him attention. That's smart. But you know, uh, some of the, some of the journalists were saying, "Listen, he he arrived angry. He was angry when he got there. He was told he would be fact checked." <coughs> in real time yeah and apparently fact check equals let's take the fun out of everything and try to pin something on him that put his nose out of joint yeah uh, uh, and, and it was and actually live sh the the fact checking was live streamed on a separate pro uh, right but, separate but it was platform, being done but it was being done and that live. Ticked him off. yeah and 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 what you know this is the same whole <laughs> stuff he did with obama yeah. You know, he yeah. made people think there was something wrong. You know, Obama, his mom was white, his dad was black. Now, if the were chasing him, they say, there goes a black man. That's right. Yeah. Okay? If they were chasing Kamala, they say, there goes a black woman. And if they, if they was chasing Trump, they'd say, it goes an orange guy. Yeah. <laughs> If the Triple K's were chasing the view, they would say, there goes a bunch of women about to divorce their husbands. Get them. And if you didn't know who he was, he's saying it very loudly. I do want to give kudos to ABC's Rachel Scott, yeah, who's just amazing. And Katia Goba did an excellent job holding his feet to the fire. And there is something about when women challenge him that he, he unravels. He and what I was struck by... So Trump apparently unravels in the almighty presence of women. This show, man. This show. I wasn't just the blatant racism, the lack of understanding of what it means to be biracial. I've said this for a while. He is slowing down. He's never been a super eloquent person. He yeah, they're, they're ones to talk about him slowing down. They were a part of the propaganda about Joe Biden not slowing down. These people are hypocrites, man. He shows up to a, um, a, this black event wanting to woo black voters by saying the most offensive things. I don't agree things. with that. Yes. I don't agree that that's what's his motive. No, I'm saying he came thinking he could woo them while everything he's no. thinking trips out of his mouth. I think he thought he could explain where the black jobs were. <laughs> Whatever the... <laughs> yeah. Whatever. <laughs> because he... Yeah, man, to be honest, he really shouldn't have said black jobs when he was at that convention. You know, I, I know what he meant. He was just referring to black people with jobs. But how did he not know that they would take it this way? The media the view all that you know people are looking for votes this did not win no, any no, votes no, exactly vote. it did not point. expand anyone yeah. it probably lost yeah. people my yeah. point is that he was really working for uh, was to his yeah. base right now that was to signal his base no he that was, was not he, 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 he brags he, about black he wait, wants, go ahead go ahead go ahead let her go say yeah. it i believe that that's mm -hmm. what his motive was it was like an opportunity to say to all the racists out there say 
Uh, see what I'm saying here? You see what I did there? I think that's what his motive was. But, and, and, and also, he is, but he's too stupid to realize what he's even doing. Well, in but, his that, but then he, he gets so threatened by a black woman asking him questions that he is petrified of Kamala in the debates. Oh, yeah. He's petrified. Well, They're just coping hard by saying he's afraid to debate Kamala because they know the odds are in his favor when the debate actually happens. I can't wait to see that. Oh, I, so you are watching yeah. a very scared orange person. <laughs> well, I'll say it again. But, but Joy, you know, I, I, I do, I, I will say this. He, he lied with impunity, yeah. even though he was being live streamed, fact checked somewhere else. I mm -hmm. definitely think this bodes, uh, th this is informative of what should be done during a Everywhere. debate. It needs to be, I think the, 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 the fact checker needs to be like on the stage. I think they have to have it doesn't producers. Matter. It doesn't they're just trying to control him by getting a muh fact checker to weaponize against him. It doesn't In matter. His face saying, doesn't That's care a lie. about That's the facts. A lie. Funny. That's a lie. The reality the other, is this. Can I say one more thing, though? The, the, the other thing is, I do think he was trying to woo black voters. Thank because you, Sonny. He That's said, what I thought. Yeah, I, because he said... He was just really bad at it. I mean, it. He, lied, he lied at it. <laughs> oh. He lied at it. He yeah. said, I've been the best president for the b black population since Abraham Lincoln. He also Wait, said... Wait, that's him calling. He yeah. Also, he, he's calling it. Yeah. Wait, 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 let me do it, Wait a second. I, I dated Abraham Lincoln, okay? <laughs> and I want to say to you, Donald, you're no Abraham Lincoln. No. He also said uh, he claimed to have saved historically black colleges and universities. Obama did that, and he just signed a continuation of the funding. And he also said that um, he worked with Tim Scott, you know, his, the only black Republican senator, on opportunity zones. And if anybody knows anything about opportunity zones, what happens is that white-led huge corporations... You guys, I'm done with this show. The cringe overload is insane. I will be moving on with my day, and I'm sure you're ready. Like, subscribe, consider donating. Thank you, and see you next time.